Well, welcome, this is a quick video to show you how to upload new firmware to the Corporate CX3X2000 Gyro. The latest firmware should be the version 2.2 and um, it's quite easy to download. First of all, you need to download the PC software from the KY model website. You can see from here, software and firmware for Corporate PX2 times, no that's, yeah that's the 2.1. That's the 2.1. You need to download this first, and it is at www.ky-model.com support page. You can see it from the first page. Okay, first, first of all, you download it, mm -hmm. and then you save it into your file, and then you download the latest firmware as well. The firmware file, which is this one right here. See this version 2.2. Okay, you download both of them. Save it on your computer. I have done that already, so um, you see the upgrade firmware will be in this folder right here I put in there and then that is the setup software. Okay, now first of all, turn on your transmitter, make sure all the wires are connected to your gyro and then it's in working order and make sure it's working properly, if not it will not enter setup mode and connect the PB002 USB cable to the gyro. All right. Now, um, for this demo, I'm using a ESC to power the receiver, the, then to power the gyro. But you can use any 5 volt power source or be um, power source or BEC as well. Okay. Now, connect the battery to the helicopter, and then and then insert the USB cable into your computer USB port. All right. Now, here we go. Now. With everything connected, there will be a little red light there. And then open the Corporex 2.1 PC software. Oops. Okay, now it's open. Okay, depends on um, your computer setup and uh, which cable the US, uh, which port the USB cable connected to. For my computer, for this example, it's uh, COM3. So, that's, so you just select the, the right one is connected. And then now press Connect Copper X. Now you can see this light turn green, which means the gyro is connected to your PC right now. Okay, now press Upgrade. And then you can see you can do the CX-3X2000 or 1000 upgrade as well. Now we're doing the 2000. So press Open Firmware. Now, depends on where you saved the file before. So you just locate the file and then select it here. Right now we are doing the 2.2, so select the 2.2. Okay, with that selected, press upgrade. Now this is the tricky part. After you press upgrade, disconnect the battery from the helicopter or the power source. Now connect it again. And you can see from that bar right here, it start moving. And after it's done, it will say firmware update completed. So, I'm sorry, I use Chinese window, but it say confirm. Okay, so we'll press confirm. Now the gyro will restart itself and do all the startup sequence. You can see the light start flashing and so on and so on. Now you have the latest firmware. 